Hello guys, welcome back to In 5 Minutes. In this presentation, we are going to see a 3-bit binary to gray converter. A uh, 3-bit binary code will convert it to 3-bit gray code and we will implement the logic with the help of PLA that is nothing but programmable logic array. So first of all, I have 3-bit input binary code that is nothing but B2, B1 and B0 from which I am going to obtain G2, G1 and G0 and we all know that G2 is taken as it is from B2 and G1 is nothing but XOR operation between B2 and B1 and G0 is nothing but B1 XOR with B0 that is nothing but G0 so based upon this logic from binary to gray so this is binary to gray if you apply this logic simply the input side we have and the output side we have as b2 b1 b0 and here i have g2 g1 g0 input binary output gray so binary inputs we have three bits therefore eight combinations will be there and those eight combinations are starting from 0 0 0 all the way to 1 1 1 and the corresponding outputs will be equal to g2 is b2 as it is therefore it will be 0 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 g1 is xor between these two so 0 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 0 and for g0 xor operation between these two so 0 0 it is 0 0 1 1 1 0 0 1 1 0 okay now obtaining the equations finally for g2 with the help of kmap also you can solve the kmaps for g2 g1 and g0 okay to solve the kmaps three variables kmap therefore g2 will be equal to b2 directly you will get the answer for g1 you will get b2 b2 bar b1 plus b2 b1 bar that is nothing but xor between b2 and b1 and for g0 the equations will be b1 bar b0 plus b1 b0 bar that is nothing but xor operation between b0 and b1 so this is nothing but b1 xor with b2 and this is nothing but b0 xor with b1 okay so let us implement these things so for the pla implementation so therefore let us try to find out the pla implementations input side we have b0 b1 and b2 okay so for these inputs let me design the buffers so these are the buffers representing b0 b0 bar b1 b1 bar b2 b2 bar okay for which we are going to have the product terms so total 1 2 3 4 product terms will be required so for that i have one first second third and the fourth product term so there will be a and gate required here okay the so first product term is b2 bar to implement this first product term is b0 bar b1 so let us take b0 bar so it is b0 bar b1 the next one is b0 b1 bar so this is b0 b1 bar then what's b2 b1 bar so this is b2 b1 bar and the next one is b2 bar b1 so this is b2 bar and this is b1 okay and the final line will get b2 as it is we're going to carry so for which and that will be taken directly out as g2 so this will be g2 and for outputs g1 and g0 this is nothing but degree output this is the input side for g1 it is b2 bar b1 so b2 bar b1 and b2 b1 bar so these are the two combinations 
and for G0 it is this one so this is the programmable and and matrix and or matrix so you can also have it here as and matrix this whole and this is nothing but or matrix both are programmable hence it is a PL implementation of 3 bit binary to gray you can also convert 3 bit gray to binary also with the help of these kind of questions so for more ideas and videos stay tuned to in 5 minutes and thank you for watching